Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of All the Mind Docs. Now this we're not on the ship, like we're usually on the ship. Um Zihu just wanted to test out no Zug. My apologies. Wanted to test out some uh, mob uh, minigame and it seems like I'm doing quite well, so but this title, I, I want to like do the voiceover on a graphics card, right? An upgrade of my technology. But you guys can watch the background, right? Because I don't want you to like stare at a black screen or whatever. And I don't have a second channel to do my updates. Alright, so, uh, recently, I, my graphics card's been dying for a bit, you know, I have no idea. There should be many theories, some theories I do not know. Um, one theory could be that I may have a big monitor, like I have a 24 inch monitor, which is kind of big. And uh, I, I upgraded to, as you see in the title, I updated to the uh, NVIDIA GeForce GT610. Now this graphics card, um, well this, the, the what you see on the screen right now, that's not the actual graphics card. This is the AMD graphics card. But the one I bought, the Nivea, that will be in the future uh, episodes, I think. This will be the last one? Yeah, this will be the last All the Mine episode I use with the AMD graphics card. So, uh, any All the Mine episode you see in the future, that will be using the uh, Nivea graphics card. Now, this graphics card, you may. Uh, uh, I did some research on it, like, uh, I went, when I went to the store, basically, it was uh, on the shelf because uh, the the AMD graphics card was dying on me, like, if there was something wrong, like, a memory, like, I think I, I googled what was wrong with my computer, right, because there's, like, if there was a memory leak, the computer would restart itself, it's like, there would be a, a, a blue screen, and it would say, whoops, something went wrong, we're gonna reset it for you, so the computer reset itself, right, it just do, like, a restart mode. And re lately, it did that f uh, for four times. Like, okay, well, something's wrong with my graphics card. So I'll replace it, which I did. But that was kind of weird. And uh, to get a graphics card, you basically like need a lot of research. I did some research here and there. And um, I kind of really need a graphics card desperately since my computer would have died. Like, it's not healthy if your computer keeps restarting for no reason. And so far, so good. This Nivea graphics card never restarted so far. The only downside to that is that when I play Minecraft, I get lower FPS. That's the sad part. Like I get around 60 to 80 compared to the 120, which is still good. There's some, like if I lag hardcore, I drop down to like 30 and 20. That's like not good since YouTube is a 30 FPS minimum to upload. Like you'll see moving chunks, which is kind of not good, but uh, that that's when I play mod packs, you know, the, the big mod packs. I crashed on B team once, which is kind of concerning, but I was kind of in a laggy area because there's so much stuff in the town. And oh yeah, okay, so you may be wondering, it's like, oh, okay, so this, the, the I got the lowest possible upgrade for the graphics card, like Nivea. There's different upgrades, like the, there's different prices. Did I say that this one, this one, this Nivea cost $70? Actually, I'll check how much it is. Okay, so I've got the graphics card for $70 Canadian. That is $56 US. And there was an option of me to increase it by $10, which is, will be the Nivea 630, which I have the 610. 610 is the basic one, right? That's like the basic everyday needs and that's like the minimum ever. Like if you want an upgrade, just go for it. And I'll see how much $80 is, like a $10 upgrade. So the 630 would be $64, so that's not, a, not a bad increase, but I did do some research, right? If you want to upgrade your equipment, better do some research. The Nivea 610 said you need a minimum power supply of 300 watts, and which my desktop has a minimum of 300 watts. The Nivea 630 had a minimum power supply of 350, so I didn't know what to do, but I like to thank 5T, he said to go for the, 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 what is it, 610 a while ago, but I think he meant the GTX 610, this is just says GT 610, I see it from the title, and I think the X means like extra stuff, which means extra perks and whatnot. There's like three graphics cards available at the store, and there's like more online, and uh, the more on, the, yeah, the more stuff online means the more better it is, like I saw a GT, TX 630 for uh, 80 bucks same price, but it has more perks to it, but it was online shipping. 
I just need a graphics card right now. But before the the old AMD graphics card, like it was dying on me, like there was a loud buzzing noise. And when you get a loud buzzing noise, that is not good. And so far, oh my goodness, so smooth, no sound whatsoever, which I liked so far. So doesn't disturb my ears, doesn't disturb anybody. So that's pretty nice. So that unlocks me to do more intros. Like if I do more intros, uh, I, I've noticed that my channel has been like getting low views and it was high before. Why was, why was it before? Because of intros. People watch my videos for the intros, right? When they watch my videos, I get higher views, make me happy and I render more. So that being said, expect more intros on my channel, which is pretty nice because I want a growing channel. The only downside to that is I won't unlock the one that I locked, right? Because the, the Blender and Cinema 4D, they take at least 15 minutes to uh, render and uh, get ready for you guys. So I, I would rather spend time working on my YouTube channel compared to working on intros because I want to experience the whole aspect of Minecraft, like play as much game mode as I can before I retire, which is it's still a long way to go. Don't worry, I'm not retiring uh, anytime soon. And installing the graphics card. It was kind of weird though, because I have like a one year old computer and then I checked the tutorial. It says to remove your graphics card, you have to uh, press on the tab, which releases your graphics card. I didn't have that tab. Like I, I pressed on something like the, the, the video I saw said to press a tab on the back. So, which I did, I pressed the tab on my box. I heard a crack. I'm like, uh oh, what do I do? I stop, right? Because when you crack your finger, it's technically bad, right? Or crack your back. It's like, uh oh, <gasps> what happened? My back is like dead. So, fortunately, I had a older desktop, which is also another HP. Man, HP is like so bad luck for me. Like, I have an Acer laptop for four years old and it's still working fine. And I have like a dead HP, and then here's this HP that's dying. Like, I, I, I think the graphics card was bad also for that first HP desktop I have. So yeah, I, I went to the, the first desk HP that died and uh, I pressed it, right? To check the graphics card to see how it works. And it released. I was like, oh, okay. So I check, I go back to mine. I press it and then like, okay, I'll do a slow and steady. Then I hear a click. So it's like a, one of those, what is it? The, the I, I forgot what it's called, but where it like locks out and then locks back in, which is pretty nice. So I, I flick it, it's like a switch basically, like like a lever. So I flick open the lever and then the graphics card popped. I was like, wow, okay, that's, that's pretty nice. And then I plug in the graphics card and then click, it locked itself. So that was a very simple installation. Like I was worried that it would uh, be so difficult, but it wasn't. Then I look at my old graphics card. Now the, the, the store when, where I, I bought the desktop from, they repaired it, right? Because before, I, you may notice from December, I had a break, a, what is it, three week break, just because my computer was being repaired. They say they replaced that graphics card. When I saw it, there were scratch marks at the fan area. So basically they just like hammered it or adjusted it, the fan so that it doesn't make noise anymore. But when I bought the desktop back to my house, right, to use it, it started making the noise again one week after. So I didn't bother to bring it back to the store. Like, why would I waste another three weeks? I can just play Minecraft. Like I can still play Minecraft, right? You saw the when I came back from the summer fifteenth, you saw like constant upload. It was still working fine, and now I get a quiet fan. Uh, I think I could save more money, right? Because the the first HP that died, I had to replace that computer just because the, it was a family computer, and that was one thousand dollars down the drain, basically. Like they they forced me to buy it because a computer is a necessi necessity for uh, education because people would have to surf the online web. And yeah, it was pretty nice. I think I'm the one in the family that, that buys technology because uh, my parents bought a computer for my older brother. Um, and then my older brother has a, a, a laptop. Then my parents bought him a laptop and he has a one gigabyte laptop for his school. So that's kind of his equipment. Then it has my, and then there's me, which bought this desktop, the replacement desktop for the first one and the first desktop. So that's three desktop. I got a laptop, which still works and that's four. And then I upgraded the graphics card. So I'm like the only one in my family that knows how to replace the graphics card now, which is pretty neat. And my little brother, not Lilith, not Mike Water, and he has a laptop only. So I can see I rely so much on technology. <laughs> that's not even funny, but yeah, technology is kind of fun. Because it's, I don't want to say addicting Minecraft, but 
uh, I'm so glad that I, I'm experiencing this kind of technology like the rest of the, the little kids I'm experiencing right now. Like the older the people older than me, they haven't experienced this stuff, so might as well enjoy it because why can't, why, why, why I won't have the fun. Right? Now, I want to talk more about the Nvidia GeForce GTX. It's still, when I render intros, like I still do intros, right? Um, when they are, the, the, the render time is still the same, which is kind of bad because one intro renders for two minutes and this graphics card renders that intro for 210. Uh, well, it says on the box, I see a two gigabytes DDR. I'm not sure what it means. Like more RAM means the faster the computer, right? So I'll expect it to be a faster render, but apparently it's not. If there's an option for it, then let me know because that will boost up my uh, the uh, gameplay of Minecraft also, right? I get higher FPS on it. I render quicker, which is pretty neat because time is very valuable these days. And if I can save it, that'll be great. Okay. so. Starting on Monday, that's like family for the like Canadian people. Um, well, Monday, they, I, I should work on the groups, the Skype group, right? It's been a while. Uh, there's probably, it, it was basically test week for me. So that was a bad timing for me. It's like, wow, the, the teachers decided to put all the tests this week before the spring break. Right after the week off next week, which is pretty nice. So I have a bunch of time to record with you guys. But I have a job though, right? Because I deliver papers to earn the money. That's how I got money to pay, pay for the graphics card. And there's also YouTube. I still earn probably 20 bucks per month, which is doesn't afford it. But for sure, if the graphics card die out again, I can um, order in a better graphics card, quote unquote, and then it'll be a, it'll be quicker, right? Because I was, uh, I was expecting to buy a graphics card. I didn't know it was the solution, but I went for my guts. It's like, what happened if this graphics card is, is uh, 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 what's it called? Crippled, right? It's not working correctly. Yeah, so I went for my guts. Like, it's either a eighty dollars graphics card or a brand new five hundred desktop computer. Uh, which I had the money for a desktop computer, but it would be better if I save for the graphics card, which I did, which is pretty nice that I had. So. Now the numbers change, right? Because I did a comparison back in my videos where I compared the amount of money I earned from intros compared it to a desktop computer. And now it balances out, right? Because it's not a $500 I have to replace. It's an $80 value that I have to replace, which I think I profit now, which is pretty, really nice, which I really like. Everyone likes uh, profit. And when I'm happy, I make more intros. So I expect more intros as uh, <laughs> on this channel because I want to see a growing channel, which is pretty nice. So yeah, so basically this is the all of mine's not all of mine. I, I would say it's hosted by Beast Snow. Like I'm hosting it and then Z, I just give, give Zhuge all the permissions and he can do whatever he wants on the server. So basically the IP will be in the description below if you want to join it. Uh, when you log in, you'll be logged into a ship. This is like beta testing mode when he's online. So if you log on, you he may like, he may be like, Oh, what are you doing here? This is beta testing. I don't know you, so you may spectate. And uh, it's basically the people that he knows would uh, help him beta test. Well, when I brought my computer in, they said they're going. I I told them that the power supply fan was uh, making noises. They told me that they replaced it. Now I don't have their word because well, I, they they just lied about the graphics card. And funny thing is, okay, there's two stores, right? The store that I bought the computer from, and then th there's another store for like school supplies. I went to the school supplies first, right? Because I take the tra public transportation, the busing, and there, that's closer to the bus store, bus stop, bus stop. Yeah, it's closer to the bus stop. So I went inside the store, I checked the graphics card, 80 bucks for this one, and then a upgrade $90 for the 630 GTX, no GT 630. I go to that computer store to double check on prices and have a, a, a wider range, which they do. They have the, the 610 for 120 bucks. And they have the 630 for 150 bucks. Basically, there was a sale near the bus stop store, uh, bu bus stop store, yeah. And they have another one. I think it was the, the 650, and that was keep on going up, right? That it'll be like 180 bucks. And then they have the the, the, the water cooling graphics card, and what you name it. They have a wider range, right? It's a computer store. So I'm like, nah, I'm, I'm gonna go for the 610. So I'll go back to the uh, the. the school supply store and, and bought the 610. So that goes to show like, you just lie to a customer. Why would I buy products from you now? And uh, might as well focus on the, the like, I'll give this bus stop store a chance because it has like the similar graphics card. 
And I'm glad I did though, because uh, it, it worked out in the end, which is pretty nice. So yeah, so all your computer builders out there, uh, do a lot of research because this graphics card, I did a lot, a lot of research and uh, I compared prices. Uh, this one says Zotac. I'm not sure if the company bought Nivea, but I th or they're partnered or working with each other, but it seemed to work really well. I, I was hoping that the Nivea would have better frame rate. Um, there was the, I don't know, the, the program that installed that I can adjust the, the graphics. I don't know what to do. Like there's so much tabs. Uh, there's like a tab for like performance and quality. I lowered the quality up the performance, right? That would increase the FPS. What it basically did, you, you see Minecraft now, right? It's all like all blocky. It, it made everything transparent, like see-through, which which I do not want. That's lower the quality for sure, but it's not worth it if I'm gonna raise up for like two FPS. What that, that's what it basically did, and it's like bad for the eyes. Yeah. So during my research, I, I researched uh, about some stuff like. Um, the the bigger the monitor, the more fan your graphics card would use. So that would probably be one of the reasons that my, my graphics card failed the first time, which is a 24 inch monitor, like I said before. And now now I know the information. I didn't know that before. Like I, I would uh, before when I bought this computer with the the monitor, I they was on sale, right? The the Black Friday sale or Black Monday or Cyber Monday. Um, it was the monitor. It was a 20 inch monitor. Or 22 inch monitor for 100 bucks, or I can upgrade to 24 inch for an extra ten dollars. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. That's only ten dollars. Might as well get it. But now I know the bigger the monitor, right? Because there's so much stuff on your screen that your graphics card had to load that it works really, really hard. So I may have to uh, replace the graphics card more frequently now compared to before, which is an easy replacement. Now I know what to do, which is a, a relief. So I don't have to buy another desktop. When I looked up the the HP computer, right? It, it upgrades itself every year. It adds upgrades. The graphics card for it is the GTX 750. So it took an AMD because AMD is so bad. Like when I got the AMD graphics card on the computer, uh, you know the YouTube thumbnails when you look up a video? So basically that didn't load at all. Like I also, I saw a blank screen. Like I have to refresh the page five times for it to load. Right now it loads one time. Like when I press YouTube, it loaded, so that's nice to see. I don't have to refresh every time. So it's a kind of big upgrade for me for this uh, new technology for my channel. Yeah, I was basically disappointed, just a little disappointed because I paid $60 to clean out the, the the computer, right? They said, oh, there was a lot of dust buildup in your computer. Want me to clean it for $60? I'm sure, whatever fixes the loud fan problem. And uh, fortunately they did not. I could use that $60 to repair or replace the graphics card fan. Like if I knew back then, I could replace it no problem. But yeah, just kind of uh, disappointed that they did not provide me with the information. Like what I basically did at the store, they said, oh, what's wrong with your computer? I'm like, the, the power fan started buzzing noises. Uh, they said, okay, we can replace it. They did not give me the option for like, you want to upgrade it. That would be nice to know, right? Like all that information is valuable and uh, why didn't they give it to me? Like, wouldn't you like to know if uh, the, the, there'll be a shortcut for you to go to a store instead of going the long way around? Like, why are you wasting precious time of customers? Anyways, that that's like uh, uh, end red for me. I could save more money, but yeah, th th this these people like it's it's business. I know I understand it's business. And people want to gain money, but you just lost a customer basically. I'm I'm spreading gossip, so. You may be, I don't know, I, I could uh, cause grudges on people so, or influence people not to go to the same store again just because of a small little incident. They could provide me, I could save, or yeah, I could have saved $60 on a graphics card, but they decided not to. That's the basic uh, news I have on my channel. Expect some good upgrades. The videos are going to stay the same. I kind of upload, I. I don't know, as much as I can. I'm going to stick to the, uh, the 10 hour limit upload because I don't want to spam you guys, but some of you guys saying you don't mind the extra upload. Uh, my channel's been growing recently with the sub count, but uh, the views of it, I'm not so sure, but I, it's good to see the sub count grow. But yeah, that's all for this episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.